So it has been a while, but um, I was uh, busy um, getting a job. No success, by the way. But although it was a nice, nice one, but uh, apparently it was gone for a month. They forgot to get it off um, internet or online, offline. They forgot to get it offline. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm playing with a um, tiny tweeter thingy. It's a uh, plotted. So I cannot uh, use a smaller width in between this uh, uh, traces. Also, it's kind of bubbly every here and then. It doesn't, uh, you cannot hear it though, but uh, I might return to etching this because I think that's a more solid solution. But this extends quite nicely to 20k uh, or, or far beyond, I don't know, but at least to 20k. Um, so that works, and I'm gonna try the etching method, see if it does as well. Um, it is, oh, there's some. Uh, I used some square metal this time, so you cannot even see the magnets, but they are there. They're neodymium, and uh, this results in the most open area I could think of. Uh, so it should eliminate cavity resonances as much as possible in such a setup. So even if, if it's push-pull, it should not have big cavity resonances, or at least not as big as most planars, because uh, the magnets are way closer together and there's a small um, uh, open area thingy and such. Usually they use thicker magnets as well. So, well, all in all, this could potentially work. And now I want to... Ah, uh, wait. <laughs> so, I <laughs> uh, made two of them just to see what it does. And I'm gonna listen to some music. And uh, it's, this is not what I'm gonna build, but I'm, I'm starting off small as usual. See if I uh, can manage the, the high frequency department thingy and then uh, maybe extend it and be able to cross it over a little bit lower. Uh, now it is crossed over pretty low at this moment, but I think it's uh, it's not liking that very much. So uh, this is nice for temporary, but ah well. Uh, some Emilia Torini um, focus, you. Song called Autumn Sun. Wires like 
notes of the song waiting to be sung For you I wrote them down Just let